What's going on guys? This is Dan French and I'm out here. It's a little bit cloudy, um, but you know what? We do what we do, right? We're a real estate agent out here trying to uh, show you guys some properties here from Lennar. This is uh, the Everly. This property is a 55 plus community. Uh, it's going to have a HOA of $300 plus. It's going to have a master plan fee. And uh, I really pride myself. I enjoy these tours and it's really great for experience as far as just explaining things about homes and what the new things are coming out. So this is a smart home. We're going to take a look at this property. All right, guys, this is the Heritage community here, and this is the Evander, and we're at Everly. This is the name of the house is Everly. Again, it's going to be, um, this is a great home, one-story home. You know, a lot of things that have upgrades, a lot of things that are really beneficial to this home. Looks like it's also a three-car garage. And so let's take a look at some of the things that it has to say here. Uh, your landscape is conveyed watered with a full irrigation system. That's good. Uh, pavers create strong eye-catching walkways, which are outside in the front. Uh, we'll take a look and see if they're in the back. Also, um, you know, a lot of this stuff that we're looking at, you have masonite wood grain and uh, insulated fiberglass for the entry doors with reduced heat flow. And also, uh, you know, really has a lot of up upgrades to this home as far as catering to the 55 plus community. And I think that's really good for everybody out there. Again, it's gonna be a two part warranty. We talk about warranties all the time. You know, you can get a full warranty to cover so many years, bumper to bumper. And then you also have, you know, typically a five and then a 10. But um, again, a lot of this stuff, you got Sherwin-Williams paints throughout refinement, hard, uh, you got a hand finished skip, trial interior walls provided a beautiful, elegant finish, as you can see. Let's take a look at what they're talking about here. You see this right here, this is the wall. And so again, this is kind of a dining area. You know, right when you walk in, this is the front door. Right when you walk into the left, that's the dining area. We'll come over here to the left and we'll look at this. Wow, this is really nice. Look at this house. So as we're walking into the left here, here's another entrance. This is coming right from the, the uh, front yard. And this is a next gen property. You know, this is almost like I said, it's a casita within a house. You know, they're connected. You got your own faucet, refrigerator, your own little kitchen, everything in here. It's all separate for the most part. I mean, it's not separate from the house, but it's almost like another suite, master suite, or considered, I guess, a pretty good large size home. It's not a master suite, but again, this is a next gen. And this is for people that have, you know, family living with them. It's great for parents. Uh, grandparents, anybody that's living with you, uh, maybe you have a kid that comes home from college, I don't know. But you look at, again, it's going to have the same tile in the back with the faucet, just like we saw in the other house. Um, different cabinets though, soft clothes, but these are brown. I do like that. And uh, very nice home. You know, the tile here is a little bit darker. And this one they set up a little bit different. Uh, it's not so much whites like the other house. Uh, this is in the same community, so you're going to see this. There's nine different properties to choose from. You're going to have less noise in these houses because they're 55 plus community, so you're going to see a lot of uh, upgrades. You're going to have, uh, you know, certain things that they put into the house for doors to not close and have that loud noise when they do it. You know, if you got kids or you got grandkids coming over, coming in here off to the right, this is your. Uh, washer dryer room now the other house that i looked at had a little bit more space um, to work with but again it's still nice i like it um, here's the garage let's see if they looks like they locked the garage over here to the left 
you're gonna have another room. Now they turned this into an office and it's a room because there's a closet here. But you look at this room, they uh, very nice. It's probably a, I would say it's about an 11 by 11 room. It's not a small room. It's not a huge size room either. You got another toilet here, bathroom. Um, tile in the back, I like that back, that back tile right there for the shower. And um, yeah, everything looks good here. So we've now seen two bedrooms. One of them was a next gen bedroom. So you got one bedroom, you got a next gen bedroom. And then look at this floor plan here for the kitchen. Now this is a cellar right here. For me, I mean, this is a really stellar kitchen. Nice big pantry. You got the soft clothes here on a lot of this. Let me see if this will open up. Yeah, there we go. Soft clothes. I mean, this is beautiful. You know, the backsplash, probably an upgrade. You got granite countertops that are white. Um, this is beautiful. You know, the brass gold, you know, I like that. It's a pop. A lot of the new homes are starting to show that and we didn't see that. You know, gold used to be in the old vintage style homes that you would see and it would be that shiny gold, but they look like this is more of a brass style gold. Looks like more, uh, a little bit more elegant to me. So you have two ways to go outside. This one is a, is a exit here and you also have an exit over here. So a nice big backyard. You know, you can put a fan right there in the middle and uh, have a nice table back there. Nice get together. But I mean, this, this kitchen, what sells me, look at that island. That is a big island right there. And that, that granite countertop with the brown or the dark brown, almost like a, almost like a charcoal, you know, maybe it's a dark, maybe a light, light black. I don't know, charcoal. But anyways, it looks great. I love the layout of this house. Let's go over and take a look at the master suite. Again, we talk about Wi-Fi and how that doesn't affect, you know, these houses are getting really good where it's built in. You know, a lot of this stuff, you don't have to worry about any of that stuff, putting it in. It's already set up or it, it has the, the outlets for it. So let's go into the master suite. Okay. Here's the master suite. Very, very nice. You know, you got the counters, you got two sinks, his and hers. You know, I'm sure if it was me, I'm probably, this was me because I got the smaller sink because that's how we do it. <laughs> so come on guys, you know how it works. A lot of these, you get into these things and the woman's like, I need the space or the man, but most, I'd say my woman needs the space. Most women I've talked to need the space. So I get it. And then you got the racks here for shoes, but you know, very nice home, very beautiful. So you got the soft clothes throughout. You got the dark charcoal, everything consistent. Now this is the master suite bedroom. I do like the size of it. I like that wallpaper. You know, they really have a nice way of setting these homes up. You know, somebody is professionally looking at this stuff and just really making things work, but it really color streams perfectly with this house. And let's see if we can go out the backyard. Can we go out? Nope. They made it where they cannot let us go to the backyard. Anyways, <clears throat> the backyard has a really, it's, you know, it's a pretty good sized backyard. Typically on 55 plus, you know, they do have some things and features that they put into it. And uh, there's not much you can really do with them. They don't usually come with a huge backyard. And, you know, there is some room if you wanted to put a pool, but for the most part, they don't come that way. Um, walk-in closet or just the closet. Not, it's not a walk-in closet. This is a closet here for hanging your coats and stuff when you come in. So looking at this floor plan, I mean, again, it's, it's got everything you want in a new home. You know, it has all the, the upgrades that you can think about. I'll have the upgrades in the upgrade description as far as what you can choose from. Also, the cost of the HOA and all the fees that come in with it and um, everything that pertains to it. I'd really like to get a shot of the garage, but for whatever reason, they didn't, they're not letting us out there. So here's where you, here's right here in this home where they have all the smart outlets and they're really doing this. It's out of sight, out of mind. Everything's custom. It's all throughout. You know, we talked about if your garage is left open, then you'll potentially be able to get a notification from your phone that, you know, to close the garage. Um, you know, there's a lot of ways of saving heat, saving energy, a lot of energy efficient things that's going on in this house. This is considered a smart home. It's a next gen home and these things are popular. All right, guys, we're going to wrap this up. I'm Dan French from Key Realty. I'd love to earn your business. I'd love to be a realtor for you, representing you. These things, like I said, are flying off the shelves. If you have any questions, please comment in the comment section, reach out to me directly. Um, and you know what? We'd love to help you.